How's it going guys? Welcome back to another video. I don't know if the audio is too great. It is pretty windy out here, but we are going to be camping in an ice shack, obviously, you guys can tell. But this is her. We got the trucks on the ice. Our buddy Lane is over there. You'll probably see him later on. What we got going on? Come in here. We got Mr. Kyle. I'll show you guys more of the inside. This is actually this guy's shack right here. Mr. Connor. You guys have seen him on the channel plenty of times. We're going to get everything set up. It is super windy and cold out here. So I don't know how much I'm going to film of us actually setting up. Connor is going to lower the shack down. And then I'll have him talk about it later on. But we're going to get everything situated. Get it all packed in and whatnot. And uh, get going. Because it's getting dark out here. And we don't want to do it in the dark. So we're going to get everything going. And I'll see you guys in just a little bit. He hammered it, I saw it. He got him. He bit hard. You missed him. But we got set up in the shack finally. We're still getting stuff situated a little bit. But look at this beautiful sunset. My gosh. We got Mr. Kyle. He just missed a fish on a rattle reel. Oh, he's still down there? Oh, yeah. He might bite right now. It's not a bad fish. Got him? Yeah. Nice. I'll get your deuce. No. What Kyle? But this is Connor's shack, like I said. You get a big master bed right here, another top bunk. You get four holes in the main area here. Nice little TV there. Plenty of windows, that's for sure. The heat's coming out. We got a stove, microwave, oven, and fridge. But we got the little Greville over here, little Peyton. The one and only, of course. We got two holes over here. This is gonna be my top bunk and Peyton's gonna be sleeping down here. But uh, these are the two holes that Peyton are gonna be fishing. And then we got Connor over here. I think these, are you and Con are you and Kyle spooning tonight? Uh, yeah, I was gonna say, I don't think you wanna share a bed with Kyle. I'll show him up top. Before we get further in today's video, I do wanna say a huge shout out to Bucks for sponsoring today's video. Today's video would not be possible without them. They got amazing apparel. If you guys wanna go check them out, I'll leave their link down below, but, the one thing I do want to show you guys is they came out with some knives. They came out with this little cleaning kit here, which will be kind of nice, so for, you know, cooking food or whatnot, cutting into steaks, but uh, that's what we got. If you guys want to get any of the knives, the link will be down below. They also did just come out with an awesome pocket knife as well, so it's looking pretty fresh, pretty clean. Kind of want to tell the folks what we're fishing. That was fine. That was fine. Um, we're kind of in a way back bay on a, like a smaller lake connected to another lake. So we're in a way back bay. There's walleyes back up in here. We've had bunnies out here hammering them throughout the week, so. He's got the live scope. I know it's upside down right now, but let's see if Buddy can't hammer it. But like Peyton is saying, we're set up in nine feet of water. We're just in a big flat. And uh, that's a rattle reel, right? Yep. Okay, yeah, so we got middle rattle reel. Here's fish. Peyton. Here's a fish crawling on the bottom right where my finger's at there. Nothing crazy, we're mostly here for some walleyes. We might run into a big walleye. Uh, that would be awesome, but I think the goal is to get our eaters and to get our limit. Fill the freezer a little bit. Connor, are you excited? First time out in your permie all year? Good. Oh, what's up, buddy? How's it going? Oh, wait, oh. You got the Bucks merch on. You got the sweatshirt and, and, the, hat. Uh, and the hat. Dang, boy, you but flexed up. Well, I'm just going to leech off of Peyton and look at the live scope while I fish. I don't got much room over here in this little corner. But I'm using the slap shot, obviously, and I just got straight braid to a red and pink rattle bait and a minnow head. We're just going to be jigging her and see if we can't get one. Oh, I got one. You do? Yeah. Oh, that's cool. oh little guy. Yeah. <laughs> No. Do it's keeper. <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> yeah, that's a not a bad one. Oh my god, dude. He'll eat. Oh my god. First fish in the shack. Yeah. Tail grabbing walleyes and whatnot. Working he was aggressive. I didn't even mark him. He just came in and clapped her. But there we go. First fish. See you later, my dude. Shop with the first kill of the night. Well, second kill the night. First, first fish of the He's got a whole, he's got a whole minnow inside him, too. Look oh, at that. Oh, he does. So we're using a whole minnow? No, no. He's Check the rattle reels, I suppose, eh? That's a nice one. Nice little 13 incher. Heck yeah. That a boy. Shepping his fish. Hell yeah. See you later, my dude. It's just crazy, like it makes that big of a difference. Check out this buck snipe, though. It's fire. We got some peppers we're gonna be cutting up Shut here. I like this, Peyton. This box snipe's not He's got a really big specimen. 
But we got the steak seasoned up here. Rice is still cooking. Got some vegetables, we got some onions, and some bell peppers. We got the lovely thing going. We're just gonna put the pan on. And uh, we took a little bit of the fat from the steaks and we're just gonna melt that down into the oil. And use that as the oil and then we're gonna add some butter in once we start cooking. But, should be pretty good to go, I think. It's on it, yeah. It's on it. Oh, he just went down, he just went down. A little bit, it moved a little bit. Look at the rattle real He's on it, He's on it. He might have Oh yeah, he's got it. You got him, no. Chef? Yeah, a little walleye. We got the steaks cooking here. Cool. And uh, Chef caught a fish. I'm on the board with two. Let's go, baby. Nice one. Yeah, you eat that. Oh, it's a gas in two. I wish our stomach home was gas. Right? Cooks so much better. Put three out of time. Dog. Oh yeah, baby. All right, the steaks are done. They're just resting now. It is time for the veggies. So here is the steak. We got the rice right here, and we got the vegetables. You guys ready to eat? I'm so pumped. Duh. Well, here we go. We got the meat, the onions and peppers, and the rice down there. It is looking pretty good. Peyton, how is it? Amazing. That's good. That's good. How is Pretty it? Darn good. I like it. Guys, over here. Amazing. Yeah. Amazing. Good. Unreal. You guys got a lot of so meat good. over here. Yeah. The steak is looking really good. No, oh, actually, well, I'm just kind of pissed because we couldn't throw it on the smoker, but yeah, it's the stove top worked all right. Let's see how it is. I guess I got left with a spoon, so uh, yeah, it's lit. Got a fucking little movie plan. Yeah. Hmm. We're good. What movie we got going on? Ted? Power Pixel. Is it Ted 1 or 2? Two? 2? We're gonna sit down, relax, watch some Ted 2, and uh, enjoy the food. And if the rattle reel goes off, we can catch a fish. But it's been pretty slow so far, so rip. Nice shout. Little guy. Do it, sir. Dang, Shep, you're on fire. That's three. Yeah, Shep's, Shep's got three. Flowers my living net. We got a special guest here. This guy. They haven't seen you in a long time. I know, Goose Lake. It's been a while. It has been a long time. Two, year and a half? Two years. Ago. Two years it is now. Wow. This is our buddy Lane. He is a local beauty. We're going to continue fishing and see if we can't hook up with anything nice or just even an eater would be awesome. For you if you just sit down. Well, we are back fishing and the boys are already making food. You're not doing fine. Guess the steak was not down. enough for them. All right, fishing is still slow, so I'm just gonna <clears throat> hang up the rod for the night. Full rig here. We just got a classic <laughs> hook. Hook it right behind the dorsal there, and split shot. Now all we gotta do is send her down. Perfect. Now we just sit and wait for it to go off. Well, Peyton's got a fish on him. I don't know if you guys can see it, but it's right underneath his lure right now. It's coming up a little bit. We've been playing with them for the last what two minutes. But uh, Peyton's gonna try and get him. Oh, nice. You Ohio State? Um, yeah, I swear I got it. I got it. I got it. I Oh, there you See go. Ya. See you back, buddy. Well, there we go. Peyton caught a fish. It wasn't very big. It got off at the hole, but what do you do? Anyways, we're going to continue fishing. I still got my rattle reel down. Lane is still big booling, and the boys are fishing away. Oh, Peyton's hooked up again. You need help? Oh, he's better. Oh, Get him, buddy. I'm trying. <laughs> oh, God. Get him. <laughs> Stuff is a little jumbled. <laughs> yep. Oh, 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 yeah, oh, yeah. Oh. yeah. Okay, you got him on the shack. Mission Impossible. <laughs> Jesus. That's a good one. Oh yeah. Heck That's yeah. Nice fish. Hold on. That's what we're looking for on the pink rattle bait. The no dorsal. Nice one, buddy. What's up, Poppy? Got one. Hoo, 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 hoo. Sheesh. Sheesh. You catch that one, bud? Oh yeah. Hell yeah. Give me some. Heck yeah, buddy. How big is she? 27. 
Oh, heck yeah. yeah. There's a stud right there, old son. <laughs> there she goes. Atta boy. Congrats, dude. That's Thank awesome. Yeah. How's it been in here, Lane? Oh, Clapping, I guess. I came back and I missed a big one and he just caught that one on that rail wheel. What's going on in here? Well, sorry about that. That was kind of random. Lane had called and said, we caught a giant. You should come over and look at it and get on camera. So I went over there and sure enough, they had a big one. Well, good morning, everybody. It is now, I don't know. You guys probably didn't see us fall asleep last night, but it is, I don't even know, 7? It's 7.38. 7.38, so a little bit later than we expected we wake up. But... This guy over here had an awful night of sleep, I heard. Not really. No? You did sleep some? Yeah. Well, that's good. I just heard you complaining about you not sleeping good. Oh, how'd you two lovebirds over here sleep? I slept pretty darn good. Yeah, I bet. Oh, Mr. Bauer caught a fish on the rattle reel. It is an absolute beautiful perch. Go in the bucket. Food! Oh, that's not bad. That's not bad at all. That's decent. Here, I'll make room for you. How about that? You just get comfortable with your rods. You have a okay. nice rod length, and I'll just get in there. Not a pike, it's a No, it's a walleye, I saw it. It's a nice one too. But I did not have the GoPro running right away. Oh! Holy shit. Here, I'll make room for you, buddy. <laughs> Thank you. Oh, I got the GoPro running now, old son. Ready? Yeah, I'm ready. Are you ready for me to release this warlock? I'm ready to see this warlock. He came in screaming Mach 10, baby. <laughs> Look how fat that is. By <laughs> God. All right. Dude, that his head is, is massive, but he's not very long. No. He's That's why when I saw though. his head right away, I was like. Well, here is a stud of a fish. It came in super fast, super aggressive. I didn't have time to get the camera out, and he just smoked it right away in a rattle bait. But uh, we're going to get him back in the water here real quick. Well, there we go. We caught a big fish. We wanted to get her back in the water right away there, so she swam off just fine. But uh, the boys and I are fishing now. That's what, our second fish of the morning, and it was a big girl. So that is a good sign. We got one eater perch. Hopefully some smaller eaters come moving in. That would be ideal. Goey! Look so good. They do look good, Shep. I didn't want to catch just a hog fish. Oh, no. You're not gonna catch a fish if you're. Well, yeah, now I'm I have kidding. cinnamon roll in my mind. That's all I can think about. Ooh. Good. Fire. Take a medium rare. Oh yeah. Rare. Mmm. That is good. Well, we got some eggs cooked and some little sausages over there. Bauer, how is it? I'm really hungry, so it's pretty good. Well, the rattle reel went off, and look what we pulled out. A gorgeous, beautiful perch right there. That is a good-looking fish if I've ever seen one. And uh, we might be screwed. The landing is not looking good, Connor. No, it's scary. It's a... Kind of not a good control. situation we're in right Well, things are not really going well, so we're going to pack up and head home or to a different lake. We don't really know yet, so we'll see you guys when we get off the ice. Well, there we go. We're set up at the next spot here, and uh, we got the shack lowering down, and uh, yeah, we're good to go. Hopefully we can catch some fish. There are a lot of people here. And actually, we got the spot from our good buddy Logan Barber. So he shot to Barber. He hammered them today. In the last couple of days, he's been hammering a good amount of walleyes out here. So we're hoping that a little bit of his luck will rub off on us. Well, since it is now midday and fishing hasn't been the greatest, we are going to set down some rattle reels in hopes we can get a couple fish. We're set up in 11 feet of water, and uh, we're basically just in a big flat, hoping some fish will move in. Did you get them? Yeah. Nice. Perch. Oh, perch. Nice one, too. Does this one have one? I don't know. I can't. I think it's just tangled. <laughs> it probably came off. But there's a nice little hey, nine inch, ten inch second. perch. Heck yeah, buddy. First, like, two seconds, too. Yeah, we literally just turned off the camera. Yeah. We got some ribs and we got the smoker out there. Kyle's taking care of the membrane. Yeah, you get that stuff out of there, boy. -o. Paint's hooked up on my yeah. rattle bait? Yeah. On the tantrum? Perch. Little perch. Oh, Pablo. Down he goes. 
See you later. Well, stuff is pretty eventful going on here, I guess. It ain't too bad. You got fish trickling in every five minutes or 10 minutes, it seems like. But uh, yeah, Kyle's getting those ready. He's gonna throw them in a smoker and they should be good to go. For set up in the shack, we've got one walleye and one nice perch. And uh, we've been here for like 10 minutes, not even. It's under you now. Yeah, it's going away. But uh, I got the 32 inch slap shot. And then I got tied on a little rattle bait here. A little frostbite tantrum with nice green and orange. And uh, I'm going to see if I can't lure any of these fish. Oh god. Oh my god. What is that, Peyton? Big, get the deucer, get the deucer, get the deucer. That's nice. I got some walleye. Oh yeah. I got it. There's two of them. That's a nice one, Peyton, buddy. Jesus. I'll mark your one on it. There he is. Small. Once aggra aggressive. See you later, stinky. Looks long and skinny. No, it's not that big. Nice little fish going back in. Well, fishing has been very kind of mad lately. It's been it's been pretty good. I wouldn't say it's been bad. It's been pretty good, you know, meaning that it's 12 o'clock in the middle of the day. So, that being said, Payne and I are just munching on some pizza right now. Connor just woke up from a nap. Kyle's working on the ribs outside, which aren't going very well, which we all kind of figured that wasn't going to go well, but he wanted to give it a try, so we let him give it a try. So, uh, yeah, I don't know. I won't see you guys until 3, 4 o'clock probably. We'll catch you guys then. Well, it has been a few hours since you guys last saw us. Uh, we've just been chilling, been snacking away on some food, but uh, we're all situated. It is currently 5 o'clock and we've not seen or caught a fish in a long time. Payton, how do you feel about that? Uh, not very confident going into the night bite. But we're gonna keep grinding away and see if we can't get any of these fish to come in or bite or whatever. I don't really know. The ribs are almost done though. We got them wrapped in tin foil and the sauce on them, so they should be done here in an hour or so. It's funny, like, right now. Oh, that one actually looks really good. Okay, yeah, this is gonna be the rack, boys. This is it. Ooh, look at that one. Yeah, this is it right here. Dang. This is the one. All right, well this is the better rack of the two and uh, Kyle's gonna serve them up. We're gonna go in. Cheers. Let me try some of this gum. Mm. Sauce is good, meat is nice and tender and juicy. I, feel, I really mm -hmm. messed that one up. That's good. There's any more sauce. Yeah, that's good. We're gonna muck these absolutely delicious ribs. I got the rat reel down. Payne's got the live scope and he's jigging. We got all the other rat reels down. And we got the hangover plane over there. So we're gonna continue eating and we'll see you guys afterwards. Well, this is gonna be it for the fishing portion of today's episode. We're gonna go back to the house and clean our fish and I'll show you guys all of that once we get to Peyton's unit. We have finally made it back home and Peyton's cleaning up the walleyes. Well, here are the fish and uh, he's already cleaned quite a few, haven't you, buddy? Yeah. Good job. We ended up with like 10 keeper walleyes and I think three keeper perch. We released the big perch and the big walleyes, so that is what we have. Overall, it wasn't a bad day of fishing. I want to say a huge shout out to Connor for letting us stay in his permie all weekend. Thank you, buddy. If you guys have any suggestions on what we should be cooking out on the ice, drop a comment down below. Let me know. Maybe do a little fish fry out there one day. Also, don't forget to go check out Bucks. I'll leave the link down below if you guys want to get any of their apparel or the knife cleaning stuff. All their stuff will be down below in the description. So make sure you guys go check them out. Anyways, thank you for watching today's video and we'll catch you guys on the next one.